This is Wollaston Hall in Nottinghamshire, built between 1580 to 1588 by the Elizabethan architect Robert Smithson, who had completed Longleat and would go on to build Hardwick Hall. The house was built for Sir Francis Willoughby, and the house were owned by the Willoughby family until 1924, but the Willoughbys had ceased to live at the house from 1881 because of all the smell smoke coming from the busy manufacturing areas nearby. I was looking out to the parkland. In 1924, the hall was bought by the city of Nottingham and turned into the Natural History Museum, which it remains today. The once grand rooms are now filled with stuffed animals of every description, along with fossils and one room dedicated to the family that lived here. Looking at the stable block now, and the other side of the parkland with the lake. Now, I've got no information on the stable block. But it looks like it's a little bit later than the hall itself. Okay, so we're at the back of the house now. There's a now dried up fountain pond there. Going on to the formal gardens. Now it's not that easy to tell from the video, but getting close up to this building, you can see all the detailed carving that goes off. There's so much intricate detail there. Of course, there were changes in the 1700s. And there's a little plaque there giving you the date, but you can't really read it very well on the phone so much going off okay so we're in the main hall now and this is really the only room that's not been took over by the natural history museum it gives you an idea of really what this place might have looked like in the times when the family lived here ceiling there the screen that separates the room there look at the carving on that 